chapter is called Jonah and the Whale, created by Greg Lugenbuehl. It depicts the biblical account of Jonah. Things around the outside edge here reflect the fact that there are others watching the process to see how the leaders were removed. It features seven human forms that represent the seven continents, as well as masses. It's a familiar sight of a grandmother who's praying with folded hands. However, when we recognize and it represents that the arts and music and dance are all universal languages, the form of a Mobius curve, emphasizing the continuous nature of the life cycle, beginning with childhood. Darwin chose to use birds instead of humans to make the message more universal.